up. Good afternoon or good evening. Wherever you might be, guess who's back? Back again. It's me, Wolzan's back. And today we're just gonna chill a little. No, my weapon isn't shiny. Chotto. Where's my button? My button. There it is. My button to make things shiny. So. My out. I can feel my allergies hitting me a little, but it's not too bad this morning. But if it gets bad, I'll take my allergy meds. Uh, we're gonna go today for around. You got some theme point, some theme point, some theme point, your theme point. Uh, we're gonna go for around three hours. Uh, we're gonna continue Mandraville. I'm gonna have breakfast. Uh, I'm gonna have coffee, and I am going to put. AFK journey somewhere. <laughs> we are supposed to talk to the raging rat. Um, if this is not my Manderville quest, it armed and dangerous, let me know, but I think it is, because it has like the inspector's log. So we're gonna keep going. Cause like it armed and dangerous reminds me of Agni, you know, I'm like, oh. Oh no, that's totally my real. Oh, yep, there they are! Oh my gosh, it's been a while! Come to a good laugh at old raging rat expense, have ya? Well, you're not the first, I say. Is there not a man in this entire realm with an ounce of sympathy? Oh no, I don't remember the voice I used for Hildebrand. Greetings, good sir. How fortunate you are today that your guest is Hildebrand Emanuel, gentleman and inspector. Now, if you would, please enlighten me to how exactly it was that you were beaten to a bloody pulp by Miss Avila. Avila. Gentle of my eyes, have you not a wit of delicacy? <sighs> Never you mind. Look, the records may say are lost, but I'll admit to nothing of the sort. I'll shut it at the top of my lungs if no one else will. That girl doesn't fight fair. I need to sneeze. I think. Tempest Blade? Wait, it's Jita? Avlia is Jita? Okay. <clears throat> Tempest Blade? Some kind, some kind of foul surgery if you ask me. Mark my words, that girl is up to no good. Yeah, Jita's always up to no good. If she were so damn easy on the eyes. She weren't. So damn easy on the eyes, she'd be rotten in a jail as we speak. The girl telling me that I haven't heard. You know how many of those refugees. What fun with honor when you got nothing to lose? Ah. Yes, and why not disparage an entire people in a pathetic attempt to salvage your sorry pride? This one's a real piece of work, Zane. Let us be on our way. I, I don't mean no offense, miss. J just telling it like it is, as it were. Ah, perhaps it truly is some manner of sorcery, as this fellow says. Or perhaps she works with an accomplice? She didn't strike me as a magic wielding type. If I were a betting woman, I'd put my guild on the ladder. Ah, Miss Ellie. The thrill of the chase has struck a chord with you as well. Yes, I can see it in the wrinkles beneath your eyes. We might very well make an ins in in inspectress of you yet. Ah, I'll give you a good wrinkle, you insensitive bore. <clears throat> If what the man says is true, it's likely that her fellow Alamedes might sympathize with her plight. An accomplice would hardly be out of the question. Yes, I can see it now. Two unfortunate souls, <laughs> souls shunned by those around them, united by destiny and a common desire for justice. Huh? What are you talking about? Ample appendages whirling wildly, sending gusts of wind flying every which way. Av, Leah, and Ulti, a match made in heaven, where it made more obvious I could have solved this case without leaving my home. What? Also, why is the music suddenly so loud? Okay. I incredible! The powers of deduction never fail to appraise the spectrum. What is he talking about? What? is it with you two and that infernal octopus? Huh? Hmm, 
Mr. Ultra should be still in the Coliseum. Let us hurry back before he slithers back off to whatsoever he came. What? Huh? 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 I don't, I don't get it either. It's been a while. Shake, same. Friend, look over yonder. Behold those exquisite legs, those stylish tentacles, the unearthly undulations of his gory, squishy body. Yes, our friend Ulti is the most fascinating creature indeed. Behold how he carefully eyes the glad Deatrix before him. What manner of mischief is he plotting? He speaks. Yes, this is most suspicious indeed. They're arguing? I did it. Oh, she ran. Oh, what is this? The girl has fled in a panic. Our friend Ulti appears to be discouraged. Look at the way his shoulders sag. Or, or the way they would sag if he had shoulders. What? what? What is this narrative? You're, you're way more creative than I am, Hildebrand. Our quarry is on the way. Quickly, Nashu, we must pursue. What the frick? Mr. Elsie seems to have found himself another body trick. What might he be plotting this time? Gosh. Nashu, not you too! Oh, never mind, now she's talking about eating it. Look at the succulent legs! I reckon they taste just wonderful in a good marinara sauce. Mmm, marinara sauce. Ah, he speaks! Uh, and another girl rushes off! Whatever did he say to her? He looks so sad. Should we dance in him in lemon butter and put him out of his misery, Inspector? <laughs> Whatever is he doing with these girls anyways? Nashu, please. Call me crazy, but I think he likes them. That's what I was thinking, Ellie. But why you look to me? <laughs> I like how they were looking at looking at Ellie and then I click complete and they just turn their heads to look at me like, huh? What? What price victory? Hildebrand is contemplating the implications of Ultros' behavior. Poor misunderstood Ulti. Here we suspected him of criminal activity, when in truth he was just a gentle soul luckless in love. Oh, Ulti, can you find it in your squishy, slimy heart to forgive us? Uh, yes, yes. Now, perhaps we should return to our investigation? If Avlia is as suspicious as they say, perhaps we should follow her around for a bit. Dawa Meadow, back at the Coliseum, should be able to enlighten us as to her whereabouts. An excellent idea, Miss Ellie. But I have a better one. Let us return to the co- I fucking hate this dude. <laughs> Let us return to the Coliseum and speak to the speak with Dower Meadow. From him we shall ascertain Miss Avlia's whereabouts, upon which we shall follow her and see if she is indeed as suspicious as they say. Come, Nashu, the investigation calls. I not calls. Oh hey Elder Answer, it's been a while. How you doing? Oh It speaks don't think Uncle Alki didn't see you following me. Wow, only in the morning can I pull off such a horrendous voice in the bottom of my throat. What's a big idea? I'm nothing more than a stupid octopus. <laughs> ah, Mr. Or am I? Come on now, I just want to do octopus once. I kill girl, untold roaches, and the admiration of millions. Can't look at what he does. Ah. Broke kids. Ah. 
No, no, no. <laughs> lower, lower, lower. Deep in the middle of my throat. Uh -uh. I'll get it in the run. Then again, in the rock device. Ah. Nope. I only pulled it for like two seconds and then my throat gave in. I was like, nah. Nah. We ain't pulling that voice. I'm like, okay. Behold, the lovely Miss Adlia. Just as predicted. Let us keep watch from here so as to not set off the girl's fiend temper. Her? How many times must I tell you? There is no cause for concern. The spoil shall be mine. It may as well be rich in the stone. Oh, this is Adlia. I, I, I'm sorry. Do you realize what this means? We have suffered and suffered long, but my victory shall mark a new era. Just as Raubana, Rauba Adeline won a new life for himself in the Coliseum, I shall win a new life for our people. The prize that I shall claim will bolster the wealth of our people a thousand, no, ten thousand fold, in a land where wealth is power, will be kicked to the gutter by the Uldans in no, no longer. And with that, I must be off to Nana Wa Mines to meet my sister. Her armor is cute. Miss Avia's self-assurance is ever acceptable. I do do some. My own chances of felling her on the field of battle are infinite. In, 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 infinite small. I, I don't know that word. I could have told you that before you signed up. Come now, we have a suspect to pursue. I'm glowing. Oh. Yes? What do you want? Oh no, I have to pull his voice again. Good. <laughs> Trying to steal Avlia from Uncle Aldi's tentacles, aren't you? I'm afraid that isn't going to happen. Yes, Uncle Aldi's homemade explosives will see that this is the end of the road for you. Does that make me a bad optimist? Ah, the distinctive smell- No, <clears throat> Ah, the distinctive smell of fire sound. Another one of your handcrafted explosives, I take it, Nasha. Heavens no, Inspector. This is far too elaborate to be one of mine. Do you think whoever crafted this would be willing to give me a lesson? Duh, don't run to me. <laughs> Posturous. Could it be that muscle head isn't as stupid as he looks? Oh, I see. Oh, no, that's Hildebrand. <clears throat> I see. In any event, I shudder to think what might happen if an unsuspecting passerby chanced upon such a hazardous object. Allow me. Heave. Ho! So he tossed it and it landed on him? You gotta be kidding me! The maiden is in mining garb? Must be her sister, of whom Miss Avlia spoke. Let us listen a bit closer. <sighs> I thought we agreed. No hard labor until your leg is healed. I swear, sometimes I think you were born solely to give your poor sister headaches. Says the girl who once fought off ten Imperial with one good arm. Perhaps someday you'll understand that your little sister can take care of herself just as well as you. Speaking of which, what use of the turn? Worry not. Hagelina. I have taken all of the necessary precautions. The warden's grace is as good as ours. Even the most modest estimate values is worth at some 30 million gil. 30 million gil! Do you realize what this means? Necklaces from Esh Thames, sun silk dresses. All the luxuries you've ever wanted will be yours. The poor little girls in shabby clothes, objects of pity and scorn for the old us. Upper crust, those days are over. After a claim victory, we will take a rightful place at the top of society. I bit my tail. I, I don't know, Abby. 
love is, well, and good, but... When I see you stand tall in the Coliseum, hundreds of thousands cheering your name, I... I'm proud. No matter how humble our birth, if we stand strong and stand together, this alone is all the wealth I ask for. Oh. That is your problem, Helena. You've always been too quick to settle for less than you're worth. But worry not, for your sister is watching over you. I will do this for us. Now, I must return. God forbid one of those prying reporters overhear us. That's my Abby. Unfazed by a duel to death, yet terrified to be caught in a moment of tenderness. May the gods smile on you, sister. And be safe. Oh. Oh gosh, other man. Oh, I'm moving this boy of such really love I have not seen. And yet I fear it has afforded us little in the way of prospective clues. It would seem Alia's obsession with victory runs even deeper than we imagined. I can't breathe. That said, I can't help but feel a bond with the girl. My sister and I were alone in the world too, you see. Inspector, did you just hear what I just heard? No? What? Zane, where you go? Oh. Okay. Uh oh. I have to pull this voice again? Ugh. <laughs> okay. Look, kids, Uncle Elsie has had it up to here with you. Do you think you could just fall in this pit and die like a good little girl? <laughs> I'm talking to you, Mrs. Morgan Wright. Hear that sound? Just one step closer. Grover. Oh, he has like a little bu- Oh! <laughs> Not you, you idiot! Oh, he has like a little bump on his head from Hildebrand like tossing the box of explosives. I, I see. Ahem. No need for concern, friends. I'm simply taking the liberty of investigating this hole in the ground, and I'm pleased to report that there seems to be nothing out of the ordinary. <sighs> Our hero. Now, shall we return to Old Dahl? The Mytho Cup will be starting before long, and the last thing we want after all this is to lose our bout by forfeit. Could it be that that muscle had dived straight into my trap to save his companions? The other seemed completely unsurprised at this turn of events. Doubtless he had performed his selfless acts before. A true gentleman if I ever saw one. But if you think that means I'm gonna show mercy on you, you've got another... Got another thing coming? Thing. Thing coming. Time to bring out the big guns, kiddos. Monthly subscription game. Wait, no. I think they meant to do that. But if you think that means I'm going to show mercy on you, you've got another think coming. Right? Ew, the slimy noise. Wait a minute. I dug two pits, didn't I? Come to think of it. The second one was right around here. Uh-oh. That's the correct construct. Really? I thought there was another thing coming! Nice Ultra's voice? Thank you! I aim to be a good, uh, not employed voice actor. <laughs> Give me a break! I forgot to make myself shiny. Uh, yes? Is something the matter? We're on something of a tight schedule here, Inspector. Stand back, Miss Ellie. My well honed inspector senses are tingling. I can feel the most fearsome adversary lurking about. 
You run. Oh. Get him. Does he have two bombs now? He has two bombs now. Oh, goodness. This time. Really cool. Ah, oh, my throat. My throat can't do it no more. This time you really worked up without a pad of kids. Uh huh. Oh goodness. See, I was so accurate. Say hello to not so friendly friend of mine from the coast. He's large. He's in charge. Most of all, he's hungry. <laughs> my voice is dying. I hardly do it anymore. Doing my best. Where? Oh. Where in the world is it? I haven't got all day. Oh! 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 Oh my goodness gracious! There he goes. Oh. Okay. Gone. My Camara, who is this half naked fool? Up. Oh. Oh, father, could it be? That aura of unmitigated murderous rage that I felt was not her quarry, but you? Ah, Hildy, I was merely taking a stroll in search for inspiration and material for my newest masterpiece in the making. And what brings you in your fr <sighs> That's not a good voice for him. But I don't know what voice to do for him. Yes, ah! And what brings you and your friends to these parts today, ah? Huh? He's Asian now, okay? What did you just come into a Manderbilt? Oh, just a bit of sleuth work, father dear. And with that, we must return to Ulda. If you have not heard, your son is set to compete in the Mithril Cup. Oh ho! Moonlighting as a gladiator army! A fitting second career for a Manderville man, if I do say so myself. What do you mean, old man say daddy? Daddy got old man say all the way in me. Ahem. That muscle babble of madness the inspector's father remind me to never go to one of their family's reunions. Ugh, just who is this inspector anyways? Ildi is a worthy rival, if ever there were one. <gasps> Who goes there? Ah, uh, thank you. Who? Who goes there? And Kiru can talk. And Kiru, oh, it's Gilgamesh. <laughs> oh, I don't remember my Gilgamesh voice. Hildi. <sighs> Saying, I've been waiting for this day. Something like that, maybe. <sighs> da -da 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 -da. Well, look you have here. You are quite the intimidating gent yourself. A friend of the inspector, perhaps. Hey, you are that. I am Gilgamesh, wandering tourist, and not so much the inspector's friend as his enemy. Well, that, um, well, that makes two of us. Back up, Gulliver, because this just might be our lucky day. Is there no one in this accursed realm who can remember my... Uh, call me whatever you will, friend, but heed my words. Zen is a formidable foe. Sounding like hot praise coming from a big fella like yourself. 
to have such a powerhouse on his sidekick. That respect there must be something else indeed. My voice is dying. I I don't know what brings you to do battle with these those two, but I warn you, you will end up as seafood soup. <laughs> yes, yes you will. If you face them alone. I can't do it no more with voice is dying. And with that, I must be off. For reasons that I do not entirely understand, I am considered something of a fugitive in these parts. You don't understand? Really? See, I will not fall so easily this time. Bad. Well, looks like I've got my legs full, all eight of them. But if that's the fetch was too strong to take on alone, I'll just have to bring along a free. <laughs> Squid sushi. Squid sushi. A subway twisting ring calling to mind the undulations of a creature of the sea. Yes, inspiration was struck. My voice is dead. Can he not? Uh oh. Oh, eh <laughs> heh Oh, nobody here but us octopodes? And there he goes. Look forward to your next life as a masterpiece, fiend! Oh boy. What the heck was that sound? And then an LB sound, like, okay! Master Hale! I hate him! Oh. Okay. Good heavens. We haven't much time before the tourney begins. We must chase them back to the Coliseum and apprise ourselves of the rules of engagement. To true gentlemen, the battle is not about victory or defeat, but fighting with honor. Whatever treachery or guile my opponents may employ, I must not, I will not, lower myself to their level. Don't nod at me. Ah, the octopus is up there. Bumps on the head, chip feet, I am one shabby looking octopus. I tell you, but they don't pay me enough for this. But that's all going to change shit, is it, buddy? Ah. After class of culinary, I didn't probably. Ah, uh, Mr. Ultras, just the octopus we were looking for. I was hoping that you might enlighten us as to. <gasps> you gas! Who gave you those ghastly bruises? B b b bruises? I, I, I fell down the stairs, that's all. No, I'll get lost. I'm a busy octopus. Fuga! That sounds like I'm saying fuga! Fuga! Ouch. You have my sympathies, good sir. Is a challenge enough to coordinate four limbs, let alone eight? Is there someone inside your office? No. No. Whatever gave you that idea. I'm simply, uh, fabricating the place uh, for a pass. Pass like yourself. Now, don't you have a better or go fight? Uh, Inspector, I think something's alive in there. Uh, that's just me. Uh, talk to myself. Yes, uh, for uh, gods. Ah, uh, yeah, gods. Working as a receptionist is fine. Battered bruise, bested by vermin, is still able to find joy and fulfillment in your work. I say, Mr. Ultras, your passion for your chosen profession is truly an inspiration to all of us. 
Oh, Zane, if you would come with me for a moment. I fear the stupidity and the air may be contagious. Zane's like, uh, uh, okay. Well, has your investigation borne any fruit? I see. Avlia seeks to win the tourney to claim fortune and raise her and her sister out of poverty. Furthermore, she has implied that she has taken the necessary precautions to ensure that her victory is all but certain. Yeah, they trapped me in there for a second. It was so rude. While trailing her, you narrowly invaded a series of dastardly obstacles, and upon your return, the strange octopus appeared considerably worse for the wear. The evidence points in one direction. The Alamean girl and Ultras are plotting something together to claim the Mithril Cup and its lucrative prize. It's not as preposterous as it sounds. I've done some research into our eight-legged friend. It would appear that Ultras has become something of a regular at Uldan Taverns and a House of Pleasure. I suspect that he is using his inside knowledge of the workings of the Colosseum to identify and eliminate potential threats, thereby ensuring victory for Avlia and ensuring himself a healthy commission. There is also the matter of a Tempest Blade. Cheetah! That is rumored to be the source of Alamea Girl's strength. Cheetah! Cheetah during Guild War is unstoppable! Which means that I fear your life is still in danger, Z. One of the guards informed me that several crates of refuse from the Coliseum Reception Room were hastily discarded in Pearl Lane, not bells ago. It is a stab in the dark, but the contents may yet provide some answers. I would ask you to bring them to me. Well, let me see what you have found. Here it is. Now, what have we here? Ah, yes. A spectacular sort of innards and intro. Ugh. And what's this? A sack. Even more foul-smelling than the gourd it was lying on, if that can be believed. Uh -huh. Doing voices makes me black like her. Huh? Apparently. Especially doing his voice. Ow. If that could be believed, nope. If that could be believed. And look here, something appears to be written on the side. Sin. Guts. Sign. Freeze. It would seem that this merchant has had dealings with that squishy mass of tentacles. Let us pay a visit to the man, have him enlighten us as to what exact nature of their partnership. Tell me about it or you die. I'm sorry, my dad, but I said it once and I've said it a thousand times. No exchange for placements or refunds. I stand by the quality of my wares and I expect my country to do the same. Wait, now, did Ultra get you? I'll be asking the questions here. What exactly did you sell to that ungodly creature? Why, an entire sack of gold truffles, can you believe it? But with the impressive price and a uh, distinctive aroma, there's only the most assertive customers. Oh, truffles. Did these truffles be somehow connected to No, I must stop myself before it starts starting in life. Oh, gosh. Oh. Um. Inspector Brarian, it wounds me, it wounds me that you would sneak off to conduct your investigation without me and to steal Zane away here. This gentleman is not impressed. D did you find anything, Inspector? Good gods, what is that dreadful smell? Miss Ellie, I would have expected a cultured young woman like yourself to be more educated in the Epicurean arts. That is the most distinct and delightful aroma of the gold truffle. An acquired taste, to be sure. But one that has won the hearts of many in the old of gourmet. Gourmet? Gourmet? I particularly enjoy them slow roasted, as my dear mother makes them. Roasted, you say? Why my mouth is watering just thinking about it? Would I be so bold to ask the recipe? Okay, there is. It appears the productive portion of this conversation has come to an end. Besides, the tourney is about to begin. Let us make haste to the costume. Okay. Big yaps.
Big yaps. And yeah, good. Coliseum conundrum. Beach. Yes, beach. Well, the merchants proved to be a spectacular waste of time. Time which is of short supply. We must return to the Coliseum before the battle begins. Here is the plan, Zane. I shall find a suitable vantage point to observe Miss Avelina in combat. Until I have a certain the trickery behind her abilities. You are to keep a wide berth of her blade. Understood? I Wakarimashita! Oh, as I thought, cutscene. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, plutocrats and paupers, open your eyes and steal your stomachs. The Mithra Cup, brought to you by our ever charitable friends at Amagina and Sun Mineral Concern, your concern is our concern, is about to begin. Who will stand atop the heap of mean bodies and twisted limbs to claim victory? Will it be the temptuous Alley of Alamigo? Zane, the famed warrior of light? Or... Who was that grunting fool again? Ah, that's right. Humberbatch, a uh, agent of infamy and imbecile extraordinaire. Or will it be our 11th hour entry? Ultras, the eight-legged purple purveyor of pain. Is he okay? Ha 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 ha! Here I am! Did you miss me? Aye, I'd say we have a battle for the ages here, folks! Combatants, take your positions and let the battles begin! Oh. Alright, you know the deal. We team out and wipe out those others. Then when it's just the two of us, I'll take a dart. Then you receive your share of the winnings. I have not forgotten, I promise. Why'd she stand in the middle? Oh boy. Do I have to fight? Oh, I just watch? Cool, love this for me. Look at Adelia's blade spare wine. She's a veritable whirlwind of death and destruction out there. They bring him tough and Alamigo, that's for certain. You are next. Zane smile. Now do I fight? Where's she, where are he going? Is he gonna betray her? Here we go, ladies and gents. Once my buddy gets a whiff of these raw truffles, he'll be sneezing up a storm. Literally. Ga ha ha ha. Okay. Young! Cooked mushroom, oh, nothing like the rich aroma of roasted truffles. All this fighting is giving Uncle Ulti an appetite. Is it time for dinner yet? Wait a minute. Roasted truffles? Braids in a savory sauce, just like Mother used to make them. Feel free to have seconds. There's a whole sack full where that came from. Oh. That meddling muscle head! What's taking him so damn long? That girl's gaze gives, gives away. Open the gate at once. 
What? Huh? Oh. Funga? What is that monstrosity? Funga? Typhon. <gasps> Mr. Typhon, is that your stomach rumbling here? Could I introduce some rusty truffles, perhaps? What fascinating friends you have, Ulti. Why, look at this charming little nose, hmm? Is he perhaps suffering from a case of the sniffles? Me too, I am. Could it be? Elia's vaunted Tempest Blade? It was that monster all along? That girl has played us for fools! <laughs> don't, don't look at me! That was her idea! I'm just a stupid octopus! Y you were the one who approached me, you double-dealing fiend! I just want to experience the thrill of the battle, you know, for my work and all. Come on, Dara, has Uncle Alti ever lied to you? What did I tell you? I knew there was something fishy about the Alamegans. Oh, that's so rude. Alamegans, you know, they're terrible, blah, blah, blah. I'm not reading that. That's terrible. That's rude. You guys are so rude. But I just wanted to, my sister. I feel for the girl, really. My little octopus heart goes out to her, but the rules are the rules, you know. Now, if Uncle Ulti would be so bold. I said, call off the melee and have a final showdown between the three remaining competitors. That would be me, my buddy Typhon, and Zane here. What do you say, Mrs. Warrior of Light? Aye, that's what you like to hear. I'll trust, I'll trust, I'll trust. Man, that's so... The poor girl. Well, this is the most unprecedented turn of events, but who am I to deny the wishes of such a passionate crowd of martial arts aficionados? The venue, Halatali, the fighters, the tag team of Ultros and Typhon versus the Warrior of Light, who will be left standing when the storm has settled, be there or miss a battle for the ages. Yeah, bet. You're hankering for some roaster octopus calamari. Oh. Oh oh. Um. Ah. Uh. Ano ne? Pa pa. Daijoubu desu ka? Pa pa. You okay? Yeah. Fly. I so shot so bad. I see. Well, this tournament, tourney is coming, turning into a right mess. With the trouble I took preparing consolation prizes for the melee, it looks like we won't be needing them after all. Of course, as long as you're brave uh, in the spectators, and the profit I could give them, yes, or it's car, har, har, har. Now, I know what you're thinking. Two against one ain't fair, especially when one of them is the size of a small house. So here's the deal. Why don't you bring along some of your friends for the battle? Let's say seven of them. That... Oh! That should... Um, oh, whoa! It's dragon's neck? So... Yeah. But yes. The entire gotcha game um, playlist on YouTube is pretty much... I'm trying these new gotcha game releases so you guys don't have to. That should be my... Like the... Motto more. Motto? No. Quote? Headline? I don't know. Ah, uh, Enfield? Yeah. I am... I don't know if it's gonna be Gotcha, though. Oh, I don't remember how to play as a healer anymore. I am definitely interested in what Enfield is gonna be like, too. I don't know if it's Gotcha. Is Enfield Gotcha? I thought Enfield was, like, action.
Do you guys hear the game or did I like forget to change it back? I hope you're here. Okay, okay, good. You can hear awesome. I was worried because I switched it to AFK for a bit. You should eat this fight? So... Then that means the hard part isn't here yet. Ooh. Cool. It takes too long. Oh, it's just that it takes long. Wait, where's my heels? God, I don't have my 7 or my 8. Like, what the frick? All I have is a Medica. This is a... Ow! What happened? Where am I? Did I lose? Oh. Okay, I'm fine, actually. Target that guy. Where's everyone? Where's everyone? Oh! <laughs> I know I'm doing something wrong if I'm like not where everyone else is. Possibility. It's very low, but there is always that possibility. You are correct. Ow! Stop it! Stop it! Hey, Nicole! Oh, they're done. Is this over? It just took a bit. And Zane claims the Mithril Cup! Oh. That was it? Oh. What can I do for you? You know what? I haven't done it in a while. Sorry. I'll talk about it later. It was a battle for the ages, but a worthy victor has risen to King Lame the Spoils. And now, let's take a look at the relic that our champion has won! Behold, from the personal vault of Master Fragels himself, the Warden's grace a timeless treasure the likes of which our realm had never seen. One that's earned the attention of Eorzea's most prominent pilferer. Gar har har har. A ring! Oh, the thief! Above you! Ladies and gentlemen, inspectors and... Invertebrates! The opening act dragged on over long, but worry not, the main event is about to begin! Do we have a phantom thief? I know that you paid well for your seats here today, but I can assure you that my performance will not leave me disappointed. Now I invite one and all to sit back and enjoy the show. A phantom thief, let's go!
Oh, vile fiend. Mark my word, you have stolen your last treasure. I swear it on my Menderville name. Oh! Gilgamesh? Hey, Gilgi. I think not, Hilda God. Greg, it's always a pleasure to reunite with old friends, but your timing truly leaves something to be desired. Anone? 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 Zay, you best me once, but not today. I shall have my revenge when I pierce your chest with my spear. Do you mean... not mean you're a skewer? Why is there canned laughter? My... my spear, stop! Why is there... Oh, I hate this. Why is there canned laughter? Vile thief, is there not a shred of honor in you? Return my weapon at once. Hi, Nakos. Oh, ho, it seems you have an unexpected guest. I appreciate your enthusiasm, but if your attendance at today's performance is by invitation only. Marshall. Go sneeze. Hmm? Now it's raining truffles, but the battle's already. Mr. Hyde, fine? Huh, uh, is that mine? Uh, I sure had a tissue somewhere. The ring! Stay in the ring! Then get the ring! Oh! Oh. There they go. I'm pretty sure Avlia is gonna grab it, right? Alas and alack! The ring seals straight in the hands of the fiend! Avlia? Don't you need it for you and your sister? Giving up so soon, are we? Oh no. Godfrey? Oh no. Those don't sound like the words of a mandarin man. Bonk. Hey, Godfrey. What's up? Why are you even surprised? Of course it's him. Who else would it be? Is he just gonna throw him up? Yep. Ah, I thought so. Well, if you gain consciousness before toss. But, but of course! Brilliant! Father, if the ring will come to me, I shall go to the ring! Why? We'll just be like Dalamud! Hilda Brand, Helador, Maximilian Manderbell. Skyward, as only a Manderbell can. Let it break. Kapoo! Oh, too, too high. Too high. But, Father, you know not your own strength! Uh-oh. 
oh, 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 he's going back in, he's going back in, he's going back in. They're looking at each other like, what? Oh, never mind, he didn't go back in. Thought he could at least go back in, you know? They discussed about what to do. And now they're like, oh. What'd they do? Did they heal him? These legs, they look strangely familiar. Yaps. Ha! Huh. Put a little more spin on that one to ships. A little? I know, cause not exactly as planned, but who can argue with the results? Say for one thing, this ring is a fake. So you can have it back. It's a fake, but no matter the feeling, this will lead me to the true treasure. Until next time, friends, you have the most attentive audience. The, the key! Why, hells! Me seized it! Guards, seize the fiend at once! You go bluey? Oh, just confetti. And you go. Nah, shoot, don't clap. But the ring was a fake. Don't shoot it. The second prize, the Ring of Inquiry, is gone! Second prize? What is the meaning of this? Many face fiend or no, that man spoke true. A master goldsmith I cannot be deceived. The Sun Sphere is clearly a second rate replica. Preposterous! It's just uh, the dim lighting. Yes, if you just step over here. Hi, getting booed. Have you taken ill, friend? You seem to be perspiring most heavily. Well, let us not be hasty, friends. I can explain. He's a liar. He sold out my honor. Joined forces with that odious octopus. All for a false treasure. What a fool I've been. Whatever was I thinking? Do not berate yourself so, Miss Alia. Why, it was exactly as you said. Was it not you were thinking of dear Angelina and nothing more? I suppose I was at that. How, how do you know my sister's name? Uh, I assure you, young miss, under no circumstances did I tell you to not a one mind to eavesdrop on your intimately personal dialogue with your beloved sister. Uh oh. Uh huh. That's a good reaction. She might not kick you. See? Ugh. You. You have the right of it. Blinded by the prospect of fortune and fame, I lost sight of myself and what I was truly fighting for. My honor and my sister's trust will not easily be regained, but I will not shirk from the challenge. Hey, Nicole. 
house. Oh, mushroom. Uh oh. One mystery still remains. Before the thief had identified the ring's fate, he had already acquired the key to the store. Clearly, the second prize, the ring of inquiry, was a target from the start. But why? There must be some pattern up to the items of Venus stone. A pattern that betrays his true intentions. The Treaty Blade, Azima's Virtue and the Ring of Inquiry, I think Rolex was quite a history, or to be more precise, Rolex from the era of Beladians. Oh ho, if that is so, the answer is clear as day! The fiend means to found Eorzea's greatest museum of Belladine's history, pushing up the prices and gouging honest men out of their hard-earned coin. Doubtless another one of his cars will appear on the scene to jail us just as much. <sighs> but, uh, now she's asleep as usual. There it is. Oh my goodness gracious! I have enjoyed our little game, but all the good things must come to an end. I shall claim the fourth, four sacred treasures, and justice shall be served. So, this is the thief's final challenge to us. But what are these four treasures of which he speaks? I know. Asa Commanderville, where the four, where the four treasures of Belida become one, the wicked shall be judged in the blazing of light of the sun. An old legend, little more than a fairy tale at that. And yet it seems the Phantom believes there is some truth in these words. Four sacred relics of Belina, the Warden's Justice. Lofty words coming from a glorified footpath. One whose winnings over the common folk provides by the day. If rumors are to be believed, it would seem the tales of the master thief ruffling the feathers of the rich and famous have won the man more than a few admirers. Consider his target thus far, an elder collector for her hard thugs, a trading mobile of the brass blades, and now a mining magnate and the stone torches. Is it any surprise that the sympathies of ordinary old dons would lie with the perpetrator rather than his victims? Astutely observed, Miss Ellie. Our query clearly harbors no small degree of resentment for wealth and authority. Might his next target be a member of the syndicate? Perhaps the Sultana herself? Ha ha ha. 
Then it will be his downfall. For the greater the challenge, the higher I rise. Uh, just, just follow it. If you want. Oh. Mark my words, ye of many faces. There is but one man who shall lay claim to the four lost relics of Belina. Dia, there shall be Hildebrandt. Agent of Inquiry. Inspector Extraordinaire. <sighs> yes, I'm sure that inspires us all with great confidence. Oh my gosh, it's the Han Nin sound from, um, from Conan Club. Hmm? What's that? No, it couldn't be. Hmm. We think Scarper may need a new pair of spectacles. Then just make yourself one. You're the ghost. My goodness. Oh, next time on Hildebrandt, it's a race to recover the four relics of Belinda. As the fiend's true identity and aspirations are revealed, will Eorzea fall prey to the forces of evil? Or will our hero do what only a Manderville can? Hildebrandt will return in her last vow. The key to the next case is a mask. Have you ever worn a mask for so long that you forgot what you actually looked like? I have. Hmm. And how did they freeze in midair like that? Talk about a mystery. What's that? Oh, it's a cold blue. Oh well, see you next time. <laughs> Everybody's like frozen. <laughs>